well as you could see it's a heavy heavy frost in the Rancho Max this morning it's uh, no breeze it's nice sunshiny going to be really nice today Seven oh five. I think I told you that. Tides low. Well, you know, twelve o'clock, eleven o'clock. So we got plenty of time. We're probably not going to go down till nine by ten. Okay. The Indians are chewing on bones. Bigger Jack's taking it easy. And I ain't seen the carnivores. That's where the dishwasher was, of course. That's Boo Boo. Hello, Mr. Man Dewey. How you doing this morning? What are you doing down there? Sneaks through the gate, comes in the kitchen. You wait for some kind of snack. <laughs> Beautiful. Beautiful day. It's a uh, shade past 11. I think. 11 and a half. It's 11.30. I just need to be in the land of Nada. However, What are you doing, boo boo? Scared to death. I'm still captured. Three hours. Hey, what are you doing? I don't know if I'll get the nod or not. Stand by. Well, I made it. Right at low tide. Let's see what's going on down here. I see, I think I saw the Mumbles man's truck. Stand by. Well, the beach looks good. I see a, a lot of holes. I see somebody right there. I don't know who it is, but Excalibur, probably Big John, the way it looks. Damn. Looks like a lunar landscape, all these holes around here. Stand by. Well, the first stalker is at 12.05. 12.05. Get it out. Twelve oh eight now, it says. We got it. What? Whatever it is. I don't see anything. Whatever it is, real little. Oh, hello, Mr. Zipper. The other guy down there is a, is a big scoop guy. I didn't recognize him until I saw his scoop. Oh, we got a nice 1204 right here. Let's see what 1204 is. If I can ever get it out. Come out of there, baby. Now that we got it out anyway. Oh, I don't see it anymore. Just in that little clump of sand right there. 
Damn, I hope that ain't it. That's the one disadvantage of this damn machine. You find so much little teeny crap. Look at that. Sounds like the biggest Empire State Building. Dollar 1216. You think it's going to be a nickel? Or a scoop? I like that part. That's why them damn bottle caps will do you sometimes. Stand by a minute. Let's see if we can find it. Well, initially I thought it was a ring, but now I think it's a bullet casing. Nope. I don't know what it is. It's a half of something. You got me. But for a minute I was excited. Well, there's a 1219 right beside it. But it's not going to be very shallow, it looks like. Good. Good, good, come out of there. Finally, five scoops deep. We captured it. I see a coin of some kind. It is a, maybe that nickel was a, what I heard the first time, and then it, I dug up the, uh, whatever it was I dug up. Here we got a 1204. 1204, I think this could be okay. Could be a little piece of aluminum too. I can tell you what it's not. The big fat gold ring, but there it is. Whatever that is. Oh, wonderful. Just what I was looking for. From this distance, I can't tell for sure, but I think it's a Mumbles man. Stand by. 
lying right there. Number three, Mumbles Man. I think he's holding in any uh, gold coins. Gold coins today? Huh? Any gold coins today? No gold coins. <laughs> no gold. I got a couple rings, but one silver. I haven't been very far. I've been three blocks that way and two blocks this way. There's plenty of targets here, but no kind of yell or anything. Yeah, I've. I've Right there, yeah, I saw your truck. I gotta get the. Uh, I'm supposed to be home by three o'clock. Yeah, I'm going in a minute too. I gotta go. My wife's got hospital, so I mean, back to wife. They did an assessment already. Want me to go by and see her while she's coherent? Kind of painful. I see Big Rich behind me. Oh really? He had a million holes on the beach, or you did? Somebody did. Uh, Dick is Dick is back there. I ran into Dick, you know. Yeah. You know he's going back to the spot. I don't know what that is. That's my piece of a bracelet. Yeah, like. it's a half of a bracelet. Yeah. How do you show it to me in the picture? That's all right. All right. You said silver, what else? Silver and, uh, what do you call it? Oh, here's a, here's the uh, blinger. <laughs> oh, yeah, man. Starfish ring. Oh, here's, here's a, here's a. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Got blue stuff it's on. an old one. Topaz though. or something. Been there a long time. Yeah. It's black. That's funny targets it looks like. Oh yeah, there's there's lots of stuff. I mean, I'm, I'm not getting a lot of. I thought it was the back uh, backside of a watch when I when I uh, kicked the sand off it, but it's a. Uh, oh yeah, that's a big stud earring. <laughs> hey, wait your damn ear now. That's the biggest stud earring I ever seen. Ah! Can you imagine that hanging off your earlobe? Hell no! Start jumping up and down, that thing pulling on you. Yeah, there's stuff out here, man. It's all out here. I don't know if you can see it for a bright sun on me, but I caught up with the mumbles, man. He's right there. Rings in the scoop. I got to go home, kick off my clothes, and go visit my ex-wife. I told you she's messed up, and the hospice is there now. So there's a roundup. One nickel and three pennies, four pennies, and some crap. But I didn't stay long. See you Friday, I hope. Land and Good luck to everybody. Well, I got another report from another guy. Not the guy that found the four rings yesterday, but another fellow that you've seen in some of my videos. He found a, a fair amount of clad today. A little teeny bit of bling. Like Denny. Denny found a lot of bling and stuff in those two rings that you saw. If you remember the little uh, bracelet that Denny dropped out of his pouch on the beach and when he pulled it up, well, it turns out it was part of a spoon bracelet. Like the end part of the spoon. I'll have a picture on the end so you can see it. Anyway, the other fella found a little, there was a gold ring found today, but it was a little teeny child's ring, uh, like size one and a half. And it looks like it got a tiny diamond in it, maybe. Hard to tell from the picture because it's so small. And he found a gold-colored uh, titanium ring, too. So, it's, like I said, this week's been a good week. There's been some targets moving around for everybody. Uh, like I said, I'll try to get back out there Friday. We'll see how that goes. i got to get ready for the gun show. i got to go over and do setup. So, I may not make it Friday, but the tide's low, and I'll be done by... Uh, I should be home by 1.30 or 2. So, I might be able to make the land Nada for Friday. But we'll plan that as it goes along. Stand by. Good luck.